hi viewers welcome to our channel dibya english academy most of the time people have been asking questions from various places the demo class how to learn language how do you teach what will be the teachy contents and all all those things are being asked by you so in this video we have our online students they will be giving the feedback most of our topics how do we teach english language in the online class and then how do students learn the language in this online class so make sure that you watch it from beginning till end before that i want these online students to introduce themselves who are they where are they from starting from mania hi everyone my name is mania i am from uttarakhand dehradun i am online student of the bangles kids spoken academy i am studying in class 3 my school name is mom pratik academy nice to meet you all my friends thank you nice to meet you hello everyone my name is sachna kuswaha i am from chatisgarh dantewada i am the online student of the bangles academy okay mania so tell me what are you learning in this online class two months are about to finish only few days are left i want you to describe our online course from the beginning itself so that all the viewers parents kids come to know what do we teach how do we teach how students learn english in this online class please go on so what do we learn in the beginning for example if someone I... wants to join the online class so what will they learn in the beginning sir they will learn introduction part all right the first they will learn the introduction then they will learn sounds of vowel then consonant sounds then wh question word meaning that mm, making why, question why should they learn wh question word meanings and the sounds of the vowels what do you think about this okay sir we have to study sounds of vowel and sounds of consonants because if we read any word then we can pronounce it very correctly if very we know if we know ne if we know the sounds of vowels and sounds of consonants yes very good if we know the sounds of the vowels and sounds of the consonant it will help us to read and pronounce an english words very correctly because vowel have different sounds all vowels and consonants have different, different sounds. sounds all right and different sounds help us to pronounce the word very correctly okay now What about the WH question words? Why students should know the WH question words? Now, sir, we have to study WH question word meaning because now, there are two types of questions. The first is the WH question word words question, and second is yes no questions. So, if we ask someone like now, starting with now, WH question words, for example, now, why why me? when means time when means place who means person who means person in objective case how means manner like this and some question starts with starts with auxiliary verbs for example do you know where is where is india gate okay yeah. very good Are you after going that appreciate you after that After that, we studied yes no questions. Okay, yes no questions also good for conversation. After that, yeah. next. Topic. After that, we studied. No, after yes no questions, we studied six sentences. Six sentences. Why do we need to study six sentences? Tell our viewers. Sir, sir we have to study no, six sentences because no, if we ask someone any question, it is real. Question: Any sentence? No, it is related to six sentences. For example, Are you going to school today? No, it is the no, six sentences. No, you are going to school. No, you are not going to school. Are you going to school? It is the third one. School. No, you are not going to school. Are you going to school? Are you not going to school? Why are you going to school? Why are you not going to school? Very good. and then what will happen when we learn the six sentences sir if we learn the six sentences we will get the confident to speak the english language very good after that what did you learn after six sentences after that we learned eight parts of speech why do we need to learn eight parts of speech sir because there are all english words in eight parts of speech and eight parts of speech help us to understand how the words function in sentences where they where we have
have to use them and we can have the good we can pronounce the word and there are lot of words that we don't know in english language we can also learn that very good very good how about the 24 auxiliary verb did you learn that topic also yes sir we learned okay tell me sir the 24 auxiliary verbs are is am are was were do does did have has i shall should will would can could may might must have to need there used to very good this is the impact of online class so finally you tell to our viewers how can they learn english in this online class dear viewers i want to tell you how you can learn in this online class so firstly now what you have to do then we will learn firstly introduction after introduction we will learn sounds of vowel then sounds of consonants then we will learn the six sentences then we will learn w h question word meaning then we will learn this yes no question then auxiliary verbs then eight parts of speech and in eight parts of speech we finished the nouns and now we are at the 10th topic means pronoun okay how about the speaking practice to do students get enough time for speaking practice can they improve their speaking practice in this online class <laughs> yes sir because our our classes of i think so approximately i think so one and a half no one and half hours so as so we divided our class into the two parts so first part is for learning grammar and second part is for conversation so every child get the chance for the conversation practice okay what kind of chance they get and what do they practice so they practice in the conversation pra practice sometimes we get the topic what we learn in the particular class and sometimes we get the topic any other like for example school na family and uh, anything it can be i think it can be all right so dear viewers as you have heard something from mania instead of i explaining you what do i teach how do i teach how do we teach so it is better to get feedback from our students how are they learning english language teaching language is a privilege for us and teaching language is very important for the students especially the kids joining from different states so make sure that the kids learn english when they are kids in the small ages itself because it is very important for their education so make sure that if you have time so do join the online classes so seats are limited let us know in advance so we will be happy to assist you because we want to make sure that students from different parts in india they learn english especially kids they get the opportunity learning english language having conversation practice with us meeting students from different states and then learning together learning grammar doing conversation practice and all all those things will give them lot of confidence so finally we would be happy to assist you 